Ciao! Hello and welcome everyone. Thank you for joining us online tuning in on this momentous occasion to celebrate this exclusive Vespa 75th edition in Malaysia. Birthday greetings to Vespa lovers all around the world. I am Sunshine Ayin and it is my pleasure to be your host for the celebratory time ahead. As Vespa celebrates its 75th birthday, Vespa surpasses the milestone of 19 million units produced. Beginning from the spring of 1946, this including almost 2 million in the last decade alone. It is no surprise that Vespa is much more than just a scooter. It's a culture phenomenon. From the 23rd April 1946 to patent filing day to 2021, 75 years of history during which the Vespa has taken the roads of the entire world up by a whole new gear. A period that has seen the Vespa lead new trends in social custom, music, youth culture, accompany the growth of countries and continents and become a timeless icon. A symbol of contemporary living, an example of Italian style and technology. What better way to kick off the show and be part of this extraordinary journey celebrating this very special milestone together with all of you out there. The fans, the enthusiasts from all parts of the globe, my firstly inviting Mr. Juan Chawis, General Manager of Data Resources, the sole importer and distributor in Malaysia to the stage. Thank you, Sunshine. Ladies and gentlemen, fellow Malaysians, hi, I'm Joan. Here to introduce you two special edition models in Malaysia. But allow me before I proceed to do a public announcement. For those who have yet to register for the vaccine or have not taken their vaccine, please do so. Hi, Ed, I'm very fortunate to have completed my two dose of vaccine, not only to protect myself, but to also protect the loved ones around me my family, my friends, as well as my colleagues. This concept is now carried on to this launch where we bring you virtually to connect to you and to be safe. 2021 is an important year for us as we celebrate our 75 years anniversary. Turning back the clock to 1946, in the post-war era of Italy, where they needed a personal mobility that was on a budget and practical. The designers at Piaggio decided to design what we have today as Vespa. A big rear end that covered the engine with a flat floorboard and a prominent front fairing. That is to protect it against the elements of the poor infrastructure at that time. This prototype was shown on to Enrico Piaggio, which instantly saw it from the top. It looked like a WAPS. An Italian is known to be Vespa. And that's how the name came about. In the decades that it was sold, since 1946, it ran into thousands and was instantly a success. And today, Vespas are sold in millions and represented in 83 countries, becoming a symbol and an icon loved by many. And as the tagline be it, Vespa, 75 years young. This phenomenon is not only globally but also in Malaysia where it existed before our Merdeka and officially represented after our Merdeka. From what I understand, the 1950 Vespas are still running and kept by their owners to be passed down to generations. It is indeed a global love affair. This is possible with the construction of the Vespa which is metal body. As technology advances, we now it has it precisionally stamped, robotically welded, primer coated, as well as painted to your favorite colors. Combined with better electronics, new engines that is more efficient, better ride and handling, the Vespa has evolved. You can now have your Vespa both in petrol and electric. However, the design remains as iconic as ever. As I leave you, please 
I again once again remind everybody, please get yourself vaccinated. Adhere to the current SOPs. Lindungi kita, lindungi semua. Sekian terima kasih. Thank you. Vespa nasce nel 1946 con l'obiettivo di rimettere in moto l'Italia. Vespa non è solo un mezzo di trasporto, è un'icona senza tempo, che grazie alla sua storia è diventata un mito. Vespa è così, sempre al passo coi tempi, ma sempre fedele e coerente con se stessa, con i propri valori e i propri stilemi. In questi 75 anni di storia Vespa si è diffusa in tutto il mondo, unendo in un'unica passione i giovani di culture lontane e diverse. Vespa è stata rivoluzionaria e anticipatrice dei tempi anche nella sua comunicazione, utilizzando sempre un linguaggio bold, fresco, contemporaneo. Tutte campagne pubblicitarie assolutamente attuali, tanto che abbiamo deciso nel 2020 di riprendere il claim del Vespizzatevi perché ci sembrava davvero contemporaneo. A Vespa auguro di continuare a portare colore, gioia e libertà nella vita di chi la incontra. Vespa is essentially the thrill and the freedom of riding the most beloved set of two wheels of all time. Born out of the desire to create an innovative product for individual mobility. First, a motor scooter was built on the model of small motorcycles for parachutists and then a prototype that revolutionized the concept that had dominated the classic motorcycle layout until then. A vehicle was created with a stress-bearing body, direct drive, with a gear shift on the handlebar. The classic front fork disappeared in favor of a single-sided swing arm that made tire changes easier and, above all, the frame disappeared. Replaced by a stress-bearing body capable of protecting the rider from dirt and bumper clothing. The Vespa design patent filing date is 23rd April 1946. Vespa represented the joy of living and racing towards the future and this is why it soon became an icon of freedom and emancipation for guys and girls all over the world. This wealth of Vespa values was accompanied throughout the years by a style and technology always on the cutting edge in the various decades of its life. What better way to mark Vespa's 75th anniversary than to launch a special edition? Spontaneous, simple and zippy, the Vespa has long attracted and inspired creative talents from all around the globe, sparking collaborations ranging from Dior to Raid and Sean Wooterspoon. Even at the ripe old age of 75, it remains contemporary as ever. Radiance play its part in creating a more vibrant and positive tomorrow. This once in a lifetime gems is destined to have hearts a flutter and pulses racing. Now we invite both Mr. Juan and Mr. Tan Sun Wei to the world stage to launch the very special edition representing a zest for life and desire to embrace the future. Please activate the start to unveil these two wheels icons in Malaysia. Mr. Huang Chao Wei, General Manager, DD Resources, Sun Bahad, accompanied by Mr. Tan Sun Wei, Head of Piaggio, 
brand. DD Resources Sundrian Bahad. To officially launch the Vespa 75th Anniversary Series. Now, to all the viewers online be part of this journey and launch, we would like to say that there will be three questions that will be asked about the Vespa 75th anniversary. The first person to correctly answer will get the official Vespa 75th anniversary merchandise, which will be announcing at the end of this show via our official Vespa Malaysia Facebook page. First question. What is the patent filing date for Vespa? You live here? Yeah, everything good is above the surface. What's that? Oh, it's just the greatest thing that humans ever made. The Vespa. Whoa, Vespa is freedom. <sighs> Soon you'll be ours, sweet Vespa. <laughs> Luca, take over! Celebrating 75 years of Vespa and Disney and Pixar's Luca. It's so beautiful. Yes, we need it. Vespa celebrates 75th years and reaches the extraordinary milestone of 19 million units produced. Beginning from the spring of 1946, the Vespa that celebrates the 19 million is a GTS 300 in 75th anniversary special edition and was assembled in a Puntentera plant, where Vespa has been manufactured uninterrupted since 1946. Vespa innova sempre, è partita con una scocca portante che prima di lei non c'era e ha continuato declinando il concetto di leggerezza, di flessibilità d'uso e di agilità. E poi per tutti i 75 anni della sua storia ha continuato a seminare innovazione. Tant'è vero che il gruppo, quando ha deciso di entrare nel mondo dell'elettrificazione, ha pensato a Vespa con un concetto assolutamente innovativo, completamente sviluppato in casa. L'innovazione fa parte del suo DNA e Vespa lo fa senza mai rinnegare se stessa e anche per questo è inimitabile. Vespa sicuramente nei prossimi anni passerà attraverso tutti quei combustibili alternativi che aiuteranno il pianeta a essere decarbonizzato. Probabilmente alla fine dei prossimi 75 anni volerà e magari non avrà più neppure un motore. Per celebrare i 75 anni di Vespa siamo partiti da un concetto, Vespa è un'icona. Siamo andati quindi a cercare le figure femminili iconiche degli anni 40. Dalla ricerca sugli anni 40 sono emersi dei colori bellissimi, il blu come lo zaffiro, il rosso come il rubino, il giallo come lo zolfo, il giallo 75. Il 75 è sussurrato su Vespa sia attraverso il colore, quindi un tono su tono, ma anche attraverso la grafica. Il numero è grande ed è tagliato, per questo diventa un elemento decorativo. In occasione dei 75 anni di Vespa abbiamo disegnato per lei una borsa che ricorda la ruota di scorta presente su alcuni modelli degli anni 40 sul portapacchi posteriore. Io auguro a Vespa di continuare a farcene vedere di tutti i colori. Wow! What an insightful video! I hope you viewers enjoy it. And now is the second question. Where was Vespa manufactured? Inheriting the classic and irreverent DNA peculiar to Vespa and ready to call it the future for fans and enthusiasts out there. 
Vespa has long invited creative talents incorporated technical accents that make it truly unique. We now invite Mr. Tan Sun Wei, head of Kiajo brand, DD Resources, the sole importer and distributor in Malaysia, to talk about the officially launched Vespa 75th anniversary unique design and character. Hi, I'm Tan, head of Kiajo brand. So to celebrate the Vespa 75 anniversary, it's a new special series. Vespa 75 has been created for the Vespa Primar 150 and the Vespa GTS 300. It will be only available for 2021. The Vespa 75 body, all still as usual, is presented in 75 original metallic yellow, developed specifically for the new series of the contemporary interpretation of the huge invoke in the 1940s. The colours evokes the heritage, innovative spirit and the fashion-loving style of the Vespa. The side panel and the front lugger display a number of 75 slightly stronger seats, creating a quietly elegant tune-on-tune -tune effect, which is repeated on the front of the scooter, where the traditional tie is an opaque pirate yellow. The two wheelers also feature a special new bark leather seat in a smoke grey with piping. Wheel rims painted in grey, the sticker was amplified on the maga for the GTS only with the folded footrest away. The rear rack is also chrome painted and the round brakes come with a shoulder strap and mounted on the rear rack. Made from the new bark leather, this is the same colour as the seat. It also comes with a waterproof cover. Like all Vespa series edition, the series is identified with the plate behind the leg shield. In terms of technology, the Vespa 75 represents the top of the line. All the models of this anniversary version are equipped with a 4.3 TFT color display with the MIA smartphone connectivity. To mark the exclusivity, each Vespa 75 comes with a welcome kit including of the vintage steel Vespa plate, a personal owner book, and also the collector's postcard. 75 anniversary series merchandise is also available to our fellow Malaysia, which is the 75 anniversary helmet, t-shirt, bag, and cap. And we also have the anniversary 75 mark. The official sharing price of the Vespa Primarera anniversary is 23,500 and the same selling price of the Primavera GTS 375 anniversary is 38,900. Joining us now through catching lifestyle stories and focus on 75th anniversary editions. We hear from existing Vespa owners that have redefined the rules of contemporary life. As Vespa surpasses the milestone of 19 million units produced, including almost 2 million in the last decade alone, it is no surprise that the Vespa is much more than just a scooter. It is a global culture phenomenon. When did your love affair with Vespa begin? It all started in 2012 when I purchased a Vespa LX150. At the time, the purpose of my purchase was simply to make my commute to work. It's like of the current situation of rising gasoline price, it has spoke spark and interest in the Vespa over time as it has been mixed in the Vespa community. Basically, Vespa ni uh, hadir dalam hidup I since 2014. Okay, it was LX150. So, this Vespa make me feel like something else. Whereby, dia tak ada sama macam moto-moto yang lain. So, I used to ride dengan moto yang CC lebih besar. Tapi Vespa dia bagi keunikan yang lebih berbeza daripada mana-mana motor. Uh, actually, come first with music. Uh, I was so 
in love with uh, mod music, mod lifestyle. So uh, what completes a mod lifestyle is of course the uh, classic scooters, which is Vespa. It, it was back then in uh, late 90s and early 2000. I got my first Vespa Sprint 1971 in the year 2000. Vespa it started with the gift from uh, my wife as a wedding gift. That was a uh, LX150. I've been using that for two years and I, I upgrade the Vespa to Vespa GTS 300. What made you choose Vespa that you currently ride? Too many things, include the brand itself and its vintage appearance. The Vespa is a true fashion icon. It's not your average scooter. It is heavier and more stable due its 80% pattern construction. I own two Vespa, a LX150 and GTS 300. It has a very comfortable and classic appearance. And the riding position on the bike is very comfortable. You will enjoy a long ride on this. And it has a large fuel tank capacity and it has uh, automatic transmission which makes life easier. Last time I had the LX150. Okay, mungkin dengan keadaan fizikal saya sekarang ni tak sesuai. Jadi I used to find a, a bigger uh, I mean a bigger size of Vespa which is suitable for me is 3 300. Uh, GTS 300 jangan risau guys. Berat saya macam ni pun boleh bawa riding 140 130 easily you can cruise. I currently own uh, two Vespas. Uh, one is uh, Vespa Super Sport 180 SS 180. The other one which I use every day to work is uh, my old Vespa Sprint 1971 150. And yeah, I've been using Vespa for everyday life. So that's just Vespa is life for me. The exclusive 75th anniversary Vespa celebrates 75 years of joyful style. And as we celebrate its 75th birthday, it's a connection shared with Vespa owners globally. Have you connected with other Vespa owners? And what is the experience when making that relationship or bond when it was formed? Sejak I bawa Vespa ni, banyak pengalaman yang I dah jumpa. Ramai kawan-kawan yang sebelum ni I tak pernah kenal, berlatar belakangkan dengan everybody yang berbeza-beza. You know? Ada yang bekerja yang sebagai penghantar makanan, ada juga yang profesional punya level. Si uh, semua dalam satu komuniti yang sangat 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 harmoni. Okey, bila kita berjumpa orang, kita berkenal dengan orang banyak yang kita akan dapat bersama. Kita boleh discuss anything bukan setakat Vespa, life, lifestyle, kerja. In my experience of riding a Vespa. Uh, in terms of the friendship, the communities, uh, I think the memories is more than what that we sometimes, which is different from others uh, scooter brands. Uh, in terms of friendship, I think if you go around in every state or the whole country, you just can meet up if whether it's the first time you meet up with the Vespa owner. I think you can go along with them easily. Vespa lovers who have experienced the thrill and the freedom of the most beloved set of two wheels of all time. What and where are your fondest memories of riding the Vespa? Uh, the best uh, memory for me is uh, our first Mods May Day that we've done in uh, 2004. Uh, back then we were uh, young boys from uh, all over the country coming riding to Kuala Lumpur to make our first Mods May Day. All the Vespa scooters uh, riding uh, from all over the country just to support the event. So that is, uh, I am part of the, the, the committee. So this is a very proud moment for me and my friends. Ada dua. Satu, kemalangan, accident. Satu lagi, convoy. Okay. Yang pertama, kemalangan. Apabila anda berlaku kemalangan dalam masa tak sampai satu jam, for sure, satu Malaysia akan kenal. Sebab apa? Power of friend. 
It was back in 2015. Uh, the thing is, apa? I'm riding with the wife uh, all the way from Kuala Lumpur to Koh Samui, uh, one way. Uh, 1,200 kilometer, uh, one way. Uh, we enjoy the scenery, we enjoy the food there. So I think this is the best moment that I had with the wife. You may be wondering about our anniversary tagline, 75 years young, well, from the moment it burst onto the scene in a nation that was in post-war, rebuilding face and brimming with ideas, creativity and hope. When you heard the tagline, 75 years young, what come to your mind? Selama 75 tahun, Vespa masih lagi muda. Daripada model pertama sampai ke model yang terkini 75th anniversary Sentiasa baru dengan idea-idea dan teknologi As you know, marking its 75th anniversary There are these unique special editions What better way to celebrate than the release of the special editions here in Malaysia? What are your thoughts on this? So, 75th or 75th edition Sesuatu ikon yang sepatutnya kita banggakan You see? So, pengguna-pengguna Vespa uh, di luar sana Kalau you see, tak ada pun jentera-jentera Ataupun uh, motosikal lain Ataupun skuter lain yang uh, Celebrate yeah? Celebrate sesuatu yang Iconic Like Vespa 75 years old So, pada yang pengguna-pengguna yang baru ingin mencuba so you can come you can cuba dan perasai pengalaman baru uh, bersama Vespa Vespa has represented a zest for life and a desire to embrace the future what is your hope for the future? Uh, in terms of uh, the future for Vespa I think what they're doing right now is very very good uh, because uh, they are now is uh, coming up with new models new technologies you know, since the first day until today, Vespa has never left behind. It, they, they are always a pioneer. In, as you know, it, it is the first scooter in the world. So it is, it is pioneering every advanced technology to, to make sure your, your riding is very, very good on the street or anywhere. What is your personal message to everyone out there who have not experienced joy, fun and freedom of owning a Vespa? So, pada pengguna-pengguna yang ingin mencuba excitement, you know, thrill bila you riding the Vespa, you can try first. You see how they, they feel, the, the handling, the cruising part. Cuba bercampur gaul dulu dengan member-member Vespa, rasakan dulu. Lepas tu boleh decide, nak beli atau tidak. A Vespa is not your average scooter. I think it's different from other brand. So once you own a Vespa, it's not that you only own the bike. You, I think you bought the friendship, you bought the community, you bought the lifestyle. Happy birthday, Vespa lovers! You are the true icon. And now, here comes the last and third question. Name the models for the Vespa 75th Anniversary Series. To all those viewers out there, if you want to stand a chance to win, forget not to lock in your answers and submit it over to our Vespa official Facebook page. Wishing you all the best. And now, we would like to share some testimonials and wishes from our Vespa owners all around Malaysia showing their celebration for the 75th year anniversary of Vespa. Enjoy! Uh, hi, saya Mamu dari Vespa Club Malaysia. 
Saya telah menggunakan Vespa ni sejak tahun 2000 Selamat hari jadi Vespa ke-75 Stay safe, stay at home Guys, cheers Hello, I'm Abdul Halim from Vespa Club Malaysia Kuala Kangsa Chapter. Happy 75th anniversary for Vespa. Ciao. Saya Tom daripada Motor Vespa Jumaat. Dan lain sekali kita ingin mengucapkan selamat hari lahir yang ke-25 tahun untuk Vespa. Kami ingin mengucapkan selamat ulang tahun ke-75 Vespa. Hero Vespa! Hero Vespa! Hai, saya Zab daripada JB. Apa yang boleh saya katakan? Vespa is the best. Vespa is icon of style. So, di sini saya ingin mengucapkan uh, Happy birthday Vespa, Happy 75th anniversary, Long live Vespa. Vespa is not just a scooter. It's a fashion, it's a lifestyle, and it's a happiness when every day I'm riding. I couldn't find in the world everyone doesn't like and doesn't love in Vespa. Happy 75th anniversary. Happy birthday. Hai assalamualaikum. Saya Akbar Sahri, pengacara TV di Saluran 801 Astro Arena. Saya ni sebenarnya adalah peminat uh, kenderaan dua roda, motorlah tu saja kan. Di kesempatan ini saya nak ucapkan uh, selamat ulang tahun ke-75 untuk Vespa. 75 tahun lah, oh, lama betul lah. Happy birthday untuk Vespa. Memang terbaik. A special thanks to all viewers for joining us here today. The Vespa owners and all the Vespa enthusiasts all around the world. The winner will be announced after the live session via Vespa Malaysia social media page. Congratulations to the winners. Congratulations to Vespa and DD Resources for the launch Vespa 75th Anniversary Series. Vespa is ready to color the future. Vespa, 75 years young.